Okay, this is my cable modem, and I have a fan that's right next to it. This fan. Um, I left it off for about um, 30 minutes. So I'm gonna check how much the temperature is right now with this thing. It's about a little bit closer. Let me use the laser instead. It's about 85 degrees, 88. 87 to 88 degrees Fahrenheit right now. Depending on where I'm pointing, the temperature change tends to change. Okay, roughly it's about 84 to 88 degrees F. Turn the laser beam off and use infrared. Okay, let's say it's about 88 degrees, okay? So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn the fan on. So now you can hear the fan. It's on. And I'm going to leave it on for about um, 30 minutes and I'm going to, then I'll be back and I'll Now I'm back, I'm going to check the temperature. And it's about 80 degrees Fahrenheit. It's about 8 degrees Fahrenheit less when I employed the fan. I'm going to use a laser as well. About the same. 80 degrees. So having the fan right next to the cable modem actually keeps the cable modem cooler, which will probably help it last a lot longer. Okay, thanks for watching. Okay, now it's uh, afternoon right now. It's about five o'clock. I'm gonna check the temperature with the fan on. As you can see, it's about 88 degrees Fahrenheit. And right now it's pretty hot in this room. degrees Fahrenheit 88.2 I'm gonna point it at the wall and see what the temperature is 85 degrees when I point it at the wall I'm gonna point it at the cable modem it's about 88 degrees and the fans on right now as you can see so the temperature would be a lot higher if I didn't have the fan on, it would probably be about 90, it was about 8 degrees higher when I didn't use the fan, so I guess it would be about um, 96 degrees Fahrenheit if I didn't use the fan. So having this fan pointed at the router, I mean the cable motive is definitely a good thing.